In today's video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to discuss atrial fibrillation, also known as AFib. So in atrial fibrillation, what is occurring is the atria quiver, those top two chambers of the heart, instead of contracting and ejecting blood down into those ventricles, they just kind of quiver. No real conduction occurs, no real contraction occurs, and as a result, blood just sits there stagnated in those atria. Click the link below or visit nursing.com slash NFN for a free NCLEX ebook covering the 77 key topics. We don't have proper conduction from this SA node. A normal electrical conduction system originates at the SA node, going down to the AV node, through the bundle of his, and terminating in those Purkinje fibers. In AFib, we actually have an issue with that SA node. What actually occurs, because we have a dysfunctional SA node, our electrical impulse comes from this atrial tissue itself, and that is problematic. What this essentially occurs or, or causes to occur is a cyclical uh, electrical impulse to be sent all throughout this atrial tissue at a rate of 400 beats per minute. Let's recall also that this AV node actually acts as a filter, and we don't want to allow 400 atrial beats per minute to reach these ventricles because if that were to occur then we're basically looking at 400 beats per minute ventricularly that's not compatible with life so this av node acts as a filter not allowing all 400 beats per minute to go through it actually ends up reducing this ventricular rate to about 150 beats per minute so what are some causes of atrial fibrillation well this all really kind of comes down to poor perfusion of that heart tissue right in instances such as hypertension congestive heart failure, coronary artery disease. You have to remember that that electrical conduction system that we mentioned, it all actually lies right here within this heart muscle itself. If there is no perfusion, then there is going to be no conduction. And if there's no conduction, there's going to be no contraction, right? If you need more help breaking down complex topics like this one, make sure to head over to nursing.com slash NFN, click the link in the description below, or scan the QR code to unlock your free NCLEX review that covers 77 must-know nursing topics. Make sure that you learn this, that we love you guys. Now go out, be your best self today, and as always, happy nursing.